Welcome back and good morning, McCain. Today is Monday, April 24th in the A-Day. We are now officially in the final stretch of school. Will everyone please rise for our Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for our moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Please be seated. McCain Jr.'s and Senior Prom will be held May 13th. The prom is themed the Warren 20s and will be held at Executive Hall in Newark, 7 p.m. to 11 p.m. Tickets go through go on sale during lunch all lunches periods immediately following spring break, which is today. Tickets are $50 per person. All obligations must be paid before purchasing a ticket for you and your guests. If your guest does not attend McCain, you must fill out a guest form and have it approved before purchasing the, your guest ticket. No guest over 20. <clears throat> you can pick up a form in the front office, return your signed form along with a picture ID of your guest to Miss Shores in the main office. The after par prom party will be held back at McCain High School. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Miller or Miss Shores. Teachers at this time, please look around the room. Send any students out of dress code to 823. Thank you for your help. Sign up for decision day with your advisory teacher or in the main office. You must sign up to participate in decision day on April 28th. Attention athletes, you may now get your sports physicals for next school year, 2017-2018 sports season. Stop by the school-based health center now to get the forms and schedule an appointment. Despite some criti critical injury, McCain's track and field team still managed to muster some promising achievements against Howard and Dickinson before spring break. Brianna Martin finished in second place in the 100. Loma Thomas threw to second place in both the dis dis discuss and shoot put, while Xavier Reed placed fourth in the this is Darwan Connor leap to second place in long jump. Finally, Otis Ledbetter surprised the competition by jumping into the 800 at the last minute. Otis was able to finish second overall in the half mile. The team is extremely grateful for the help of the following colleagues. Coach Hale, Ms. Stokes, and Mr. Wilmore. Thank you so much for your, t your, your assistance. McCain is sending some Relay teams, Philadelphia, this Thursday and Friday at the world-famous Penn Relays. We wish our runners well for this international event. <clears throat> Have a great week. Make sure you make the most of your day, and we are McCain.